What up? It's your girl Sally, aka Salamander, aka Sally LaMonaco on all socials. You should follow me. If you've been following me on this journey of watching all the Marvel movies, phases one through four, this is the finale of phase one, okay? We are watching The Avengers. We're almost done with phase one. That rhymed. Call me Dr. Seuss. That didn't rhyme. If you like this video at all while you're watching it, if I make you laugh, if you like looking at me, if you like my Spider-Man in the back, please give this video a like. It really does help the algorithm. It helps boost the channel. Also, hit that notification bell if you want to know when my next video is going to be up. If you would like to watch my full reaction, you could sit down, use your own copy, obviously. You can head over to their Patreon, www. Who says that? That's last century. Why did I say www? Duh. Okay. It's patreon.com slash the real rejects if you want to watch that. And Greg and John have a bunch of other fun stuff on there. So go check it out for them too. Lastly, I'd like to give an epic shout out to Prepper because you edited together the highlights for this video. Let's hope it doesn't get copyright striked. <laughs> Let the finale of phase one begin. Ow. The Tesseract is not only active, she's behaving. I assume you pulled the plug. She's an energy source. We turn off the power, she turns it back on. If she reaches peak level. We're prepared for this, Doctor. So the Tesseract's a girl. Of course she's gonna take over the world. And dangerous. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Sir, please put down the spear. What made you think he would listen? Ew, they put a cracking sound effect when he hit his spine on the wall. Yeah, why? Got maybe two minutes before this goes critical. Broken. What? Who's that? I didn't tell me. Do you copy? Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. <gasps> nice. Oh, my God. What? Oh my god. No! <gasps> mm. That. <sighs> he just jumped out of a helicopter. What? Tesseract is with a hostile force. I have men down. Hill? What? A lot of men still under. How is she not having a panic attack? You're in a cave. Trapped. As of right now, we are at war. What do we do? Avengers assemble! What is he trying to do? Adjust her TMJ? Like, I get that done with the chiropractor. Put the woman on the phone or I will blow up the block before you can make the lobby. <laughs> we need you to come in. Are you kidding? I'm working. This takes precedence. <laughs> I'm in the middle of an interrogation. This moron is giving me everything. I don't give everything. <laughs> 
Let me put you on hold. Okay, so this is the Mark Ruffalo Hulk. You know, for a man who's supposed to be avoiding stress, you picked a hell of a place to settle. I assume the whole place is surrounded? Just you and me. And your actress buddy? <laughs> She got me. It emits a gamma signature that's too weak for us to trace. There's no one that knows gamma radiation like you do. Talk to Fury. He needs you on this. He needs me in a cage. No one's gonna put you in. Stop cage. lying to me! The fuck? I'm like, okay, <laughs> chill. Stand down. We're good here. Just you and me. You know that was a lie. Come on. You're saying that this Asgard is declaring war on our planet? Not Asgard. Loki. His brother. Our intelligence says Thor is not a hostile. They look like those talking heads in the Haunted Mansion that sing. You won't be alone. Oh my god. This guy's still alive. He needs therapy for sure, for sure. <laughs> ah, that works too. I wish we could actually use suits like that. That looks so cool. I'm in DC tomorrow. I'm working on the zoning for the next three buildings. Pepper, you're killing me the moment. Remember? Enjoy the moment. You can get in here and I will. Oh. Sir, Agent Coulson of S.H.I.E.L.D. is on the line. I'm not in. I'm actually out. Is he wearing AirPods before AirPods were a thing? You know, I thought we were having a moment. I was having 12% of a moment. <laughs> this is serious, Phil. Pretty shaken. How would you know this? Why is he Phil? What? <laughs> so this Dr. Banner was trying to replicate the serum that he used on me? A lot of people were. You were the world's first superhero. Oh, that's what the serum was in The Incredible Hulk. I didn't know that. Well, he's not that thing, though. Guy's like a Stephen Hawking. He's like a smart person. Poor guy. <laughs> it's an honor to meet you, officially. I sort of met you. I mean, I watched you while you were sleeping. Edward Cullen? I was present while you were unconscious. Is he in love with Captain America? Did he ask you to sign his Captain America trading cards yet? Trading cards? That's cute. Is this a submarine? Really? They want me in a submerged pressurized metal container? <laughs> Ooh, that's scary. Mm-mm. Never mind. Much worse. <laughs> That's so cool. We're at level, sir. Good. Let's vanish. That's so cool. Oh no. Ah. 
I said. No! Imagine someone's like, I'm Neil. <laughs> what do you need? I'm gonna shut up now. In the end, you will always kneel. Not to men like you. There are no men like me. There are always men like you. Ooh, I got chills. And they're in Germany too. That ooh. Yes. The soldier. Why do you say it like that? Man out of time. I'm not the one who's out of time. Soldier. <laughs> nice. Neil. Not today. That's not my name. What's your thing, Pilates? What? It's like calisthenics. You might have missed a couple things, you know. Doing time as a capsicle. Capsicle? Bro. What's the matter? Scared of a little lightning? I'm not overly fond of what follows. Thor! Yeah! I love Thor. Where's your horse? There's a fly. So... Oh. <laughs> I look like they're on a kiss. The guys are friendly? Doesn't matter. If you freeze Loki or kills him, the Tesseract's lost. Stark, we need a plan of attack. I have a plan. Attack. The humans slaughter each other in droves while you idly fret. I mean to rule them. That's why should I not you think yourself above them? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, everyone in the Supreme Court. I don't have it. You need the cube to bring me home, but I've sent it off I know not where. You listen well, brother. I do. I'm listening. Ah! Jeez. Power at four hundred percent capacity. How about that? Uh. What did that tree do to you? Hey! That's enough. You want me to put the hammer down? He really grows on you, doesn't he? <laughs> I want to know why Loki let us take him. He's not leading an army from here. I don't think we should be focusing on Loki. That guy's brain is a bag full of cats. He could smell crazy on him. <laughs> Loki is beyond reason, but he is of Asgard. And he is my brother. He killed 80 people in two days. He's adopted. <laughs> no hard feelings, point break. You got a mean swing. Point break, bro. Ship tough to us. That man is playing Galaga. Thought we wouldn't <laughs> notice. <laughs> and I'd like to know how Loki used it to turn two of the sharpest men I know into his personal flying monkeys. Monkeys? You don't understand? I do. <laughs> I understood that reference. I have seen that, that gif. I won't touch Barton, not until I make him kill you. Slowly. You brought the monster. Loki means to unleash the Hulk. Keep Banner in the lab. <laughs> you got played. Big man in a suit of armor. Take that off. What are you? Genius billionaire playboy philanthropist. You're not the guy to make the sacrifice play. 
to lay down on a wire and let the other guy crawl over you? I think I would just cut the wire. You're a laboratory experiment, Rogers. Everything special about you came out of a bottle. Damn. Shots fired. What? I got low. I didn't see an end, so I put a bullet in my mouth and the other guy spit it out. What? Oh no! Ah! On my life, I will get you out of this. You will walk away and never ever. Your life! No. No. <laughs> Everyone's like, bye. We are not your enemy's banner. Try to think. <laughs> Ooh. It'll slow the rotors down long enough for me to get out. Stand by it. Wait for my word. Oh, no, I would not have done that. Mm mm. Bro. Target engaged. Target angry, target angry. Dude. Oh my gosh. please you like this we started working on the prototype after you sent the destroyer even i don't know what it does you want to find out no what the f what an asshole Oh my god. <laughs> He's gonna feel that when he wakes up out of that trance. Oh my god. <sighs> Hit your hammer! I don't know how that worked, but it worked. Where is my disadvantage? You lack conviction. I don't think I- Yes! So that's what it does. <laughs> I hope he gets to be healed even though I think that's impossible. Ah. He did it, yay. Sorry, boss. Mm -hmm. The guy rabbited. Just stay awake. Eyes on me. This was never gonna work. If they didn't have something to Guess he never did get you to sign them. Stop. <sighs> You're so
saw? The whole thing, right through the ceiling. Big and green and buck-ass nude. <laughs> You guys aren't authorized to be in here. Son, just don't. <laughs> Son? He wants to show us something! A new universe. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ooh. Please tell me you're going to appeal to my humanity. Uh, actually, I'm planning to threaten you. <laughs> you should have left your armor on for that. I've seen a bit of mileage and you've got the, uh, glow stick of destiny. Close stick of destiny. Maybe your army comes, and maybe it's too much for us, but it's all on you. Because if we can't protect the Earth, you can be damn well sure we'll avenge it. Oh, I like that line. You will all fall before me. Deploy! Deploy! Oh my god. Burn those people. I wonder how long they were just sitting there waiting. <laughs> that was a cool shot. What? Yeah. It's too late to stop it. No, we can together. Why do y'all keep believing him? Uh, okay, good timing. Why the hell should I take orders from you? I need men in the- <laughs> Now might be a really good time for you to get angry. That's my secret, Cap. I'm always angry. <laughs> oh, what is that? Put your mask back on. Yes, look at all of them. Send the rest. What? Oh my god. Low key, you're gonna give me a headache. You and me, we stay here on the ground. We keep the fighting here. And Hulk. <sighs> Smash. <laughs> ah, <laughs> my God. Whoa. Whoa. Where is Loki? You sure about this? Yeah. It's gonna be fun. Gonna chop their hand off. <laughs> that 
That's bold, because she doesn't really have any, like, super strength or anything like that. Recognize the council has made a decision, but given that it's a stupid ass decision, I. <laughs> oh, you. Matt, what are you doing? Uh, That's so dangerous. Imagine he had shot that down without knowing she was on it. What? <laughs> you are all of you beneath me. I am a god, you dull creature, and I will not be bullied by that. <laughs> the best part. <laughs> My ass. Ever hear the tale of Jonah? I wouldn't consider him a role model. They just go through glass so easily, my goodness. Oh man. I can shut the portal down. Do it! No, wait. Stark, these things are still coming. I got a nuke coming in. It's gonna blow in less than a minute. I know just where to put it. <laughs> Good night. Close it. Come through. Did he pass out? Oh. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what just happened? Please tell me nobody kissed me. <laughs> Let's just not come in tomorrow. Let's just take a day. Have you ever tried shawarma? There's a shawarma joint about two blocks from here. I don't know what it is, but I want to try it. We're not finished yet. And then shawarma after. <laughs> He's... Nothing's worse than being hungry. Not being able to eat. <laughs> if it's all the same to you. <laughs> I don't exactly feel safe with those thieves out there. It just seems like there's a lot they're not telling us. Superheroes in New York. Stan! Superheroes in New York. <laughs> Spider Man.
<laughs> nice touch. Hey, And I'm not gonna mess this up. I'm gonna watch the end credit scene. So let's just skip to it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Uh, I thought I did everything right. This is my YouTube apology video. Listen, I was impatient. The movie ended. I said, listen, Sally, you cannot skip that post credit scene. So I fast forward and I realized that there was a mid credit scene. I am a mess. And you don't have to forgive me. It's unforgivable, honestly. Canceled. So I'm going to be watching the mid credit scene in my apologetic makeup classic light blue shirt. Think I skipped to the right part. Is that that Thanos dude I see everywhere? He's got an ugly chin. I've seen him in the promotional stuff for Endgame. What's the other one? Infinity War, sorry, Infinity War. That one for sure. Okay, he doesn't like humans. He's shocked. He's like, I thought they were weak. And they're not, I don't think, but I'm gonna change that. Sorry, Loki, step aside. You got another villain to compete with. Okay, that was worth it. <laughs> he had pretty eyes. It matches the lights. I don't know if I should be complimenting him. I don't think so. I don't think so. Sorry, I apologize. Forgive me. Subscribe to my channel. I'm putting out a new video soon. Just kidding. Don't plug it. It's fine. I don't deserve it. <laughs> well, guys, that was the Avengers and a few stray flies around my room that would not stop hitting me in the face. First of all, it was a long movie, and I knew that going into it, but I wasn't bored at all. It really kept my attention. The pacing was perfect. This movie was solid. Now I get why people went crazy over this movie when it first came out, because this was the first movie of its kind where you're having a bunch of different characters and then one big movie where all of their lives intertwine into one big action-packed thriller. This was so well done. I was so entertained all throughout it. Usually with action movies, I tend to space out or get really bored. Uh, but again, the piecing of this was honestly perfect. I loved the scene where they were all arguing and getting to see each character and each superhero and their own personalities and what they've gone through because we've seen them go through it just go at it with each other was chef's kiss. I just loved seeing that scene. It was perfect. I'm sure the writers have a lot of fun with that and I wonder how many other variations of that scene that there were because I'm sure there were probably many different variations or drafts. I'm curious to see if there are any deleted scenes or alternate scenes with that. I stand by this statement. If you have a great villain, you're gonna have a great movie. It makes the heroes look even better. When the villain is definitely a villain that you can actually, I don't, wouldn't say sympathize with, but there was weirdly something very likable about Loki. And now I understand why I see so much merch with Loki on it. He's kind of charming and it's not something that is used that often with villains, but when it is done well, it's done 
well. It made the whole movie way more interesting because it's like, oh, it's, it, I don't know. With a lot of movies, I get frustrated. It's like, oh, it's a villain just doing villain things. Yes, he has the same motives of just like, I want to control everything and I don't care if I kill people in the process. But there's something about him that's so manipulative and so charming and cunning that you're kind of just always wondering like what he's going to do next. He was just a oddly very likable villain so i think that made this movie 10 times better than it would have been if it would have just been a very generic overdone you know type villain hats off to tom hiddleston <laughs> for playing this character he did such a good job they all did such a good job all of the comedic moments in this movie hit it for me. I loved how funny this movie was when you're least expecting it. I think my favorite was the Galaga bit <laughs> and the end credit scene. Like that's just something you think about. I thought about it. I was like, do they ever get to like go to the bathroom or just like eat? And like, I don't know. That was so humanizing to see them all just like down and eat food. That was perfect. Obviously, I already knew there was an Iron Man 3, so his little moment where you feel like he might be dead, I was like, obviously like, well, he's not, but they play that off perfectly with the comedy in that scene. It's really great to see Black Widow, Natasha, being such a badass character. I think it was alluded in Iron Man that she was kind of, they kind of wrote her, I didn't really like some of, what was it, Iron Man 2? where they kind of just made her a sex symbol, so it was really nice in this movie to see her actually, I don't know, be a very multi-dimensional character. I know there's a Black Widow movie, it's one of the newer ones, I didn't see it, uh, so I'm really excited to see that later on in phase four, is it phase four? That that I don't know. I mean, a great action movie for me is a movie where you're kind of wondering how are they going to get out of this? So they, every time something happens, you're like, well, how, how are they going to fix this? What are they going to do? And I kept having those thoughts during this movie. So that really, I think, was also the main reason why I kept my attention was because there were a lot of things that I just couldn't predict. And I thought it was very surprising in many parts. Really upset that Coulson died. I'm I'm really mad about that. I also, in comparison to the Incredible Hulk movie, I think in that movie I was really confused. Like, oh, I thought he was supposed to, you know, kind of black out and not remember certain things or people. Like, he was definitely way too soft in that movie. This movie, he was badass. He definitely, obviously, the first scene that he changes didn't remember uh, Natasha, which was terrifying for her. And so I'm just really glad he kind of got a glow up in this movie and I love Mark Ruffalo. He makes him so likable. That was really exciting to see. Captain America and Iron Man remind me of like bickering brothers, which I think is great because they like hate each other but also love each other and you can tell it's really cute. I don't really know where this is gonna go. Like I don't know. I know there's more Avengers movies but this was wrapped up so well. I'm like I don't know how they would top this movie to be honest with a more I don't know cunning villain or or anything because again it's really hard to do movies like this and not lose the attention of the audience. So yeah, I'm really curious to see what the other Avengers movies are about. This one's solid, absolutely solid, solid film, 10 out of 10. Disney did a great job with assembling all of them. So that's my take on the Avengers, guys. Again, if you like my reaction, please give it a like and then hit that subscribe button because there are plenty of other videos that Greg and John have on the channel, not just me, if this is your first time watching. This was such a pleasure to watch with you guys. I'm so excited and I just hit the table. I'm so excited. I just, I hit the table. Peace.